Hey, hey guys, welcome back to the shop. Today we're getting to cut out some letters for one of our customers. We're gonna be doing some metal letters on the plasma table, cutting them out of 16 gauge metal, kind of the thinner stock stuff. I've already programmed it into the computer and we've done the tool paths. So all that's left now is to fill it up with the water that we've done and zero out the sensors and we'll be ready to start cutting. So come along and let's have some fun. We'll first start with loading the metal here and trim her off with the table. Let's get going. We've got the metal centered where we want it and now we are ready to actually run it and see if we got it programmed correctly. Give it a go. Turned out good. Now let's just break them out and get them ready for grinding and cleaning up. Ain't she a beauty? But we gotta keep moving. To help prevent the surface rust going from these letters being wet, we're going to move straight into the grinding room, working with a wire wheel. That's going to do three things. It's going to take the heat, will take the water off of these to prevent the rust, as well as prep the surface for paint, as well as on the back, there's small layers of dross or slag from the cutting where that hot metal rolled over and slightly melted on it. And usually a wire wheel will take that off. Whatever's left, we'll have to either take a chisel or hammer to to finish cleaning and prepping it for the paint. So let me get my safety gear on. That wire wheel does like to throw a lot of nice little metal needles at you. Catch it in about five. hot one so they turned out pretty good there's just a little bit of draw slept on them that we can finish up with a die grinder and maybe a little hammer chipping on the edge but otherwise these are prepped and ready for paint which the customer is going to be doing so we'll have these all back packed up in a box and ready to go thanks for joining us in the shop and hey we'll catch you on the next one